What is up my Deagles, it's Deagle Eyes here, welcome to the festive surprise DLC gameplay for 2015 and in case you guys do know the update did come out today so this is why I'm uploading the video today for you guys to check out. So I was actually going to do a live stream but it's just uh, like I can't really do live streams at the moment so I will be probably doing live streams in the future when I do get uh, all that sort of stuff set up but here we go anyways we're just going to have this uh, gameplay recorded for you guys in advance but here we go anyway so we got these new festive tops for you guys as well uh, you can go ahead and check all these awesome festive tops that you can check out which is pretty cool and uh, it's really nice designs on these as well which I like and so you guys can access these as well when you do go on GTA 5 online so there we go guys these are some awesome festive uh, tops for you guys to check out as well I don't think there's any t-shirts maybe it's a glitch I'm not too sure yeah there's no t-shirts but sometimes it does happen when the star comes on the top and uh, it's not actually anything new which is quite glitchy but Rockstar Games need to fix that obviously once again so uh, there's no uh, anything new for the tops just the festive tops I believe and uh, so there we go we got that as well uh, let me go ahead and put on my Santa costume again because I really love that costume it just looks pretty awesome so we need to check over to the hats. I don't believe any other new hats in here. No, there's no new hats here. All right, so uh, there's no new hats here. We're gonna go over to the pants section. Is this a pants section? Yeah. Wait, that's the shoe section. All right, let's check the shoes. Let's go over the shoes. All right, there should have been new shoes for the um, elf, I believe. Oh no, that's the previous one. All right, never mind that. All right, let's go ahead and check over to the pants section. Where's the pants section? All right, it's down there. I wish I could actually just run instead of having to walk, it'd be nice, but there we go. Yeah, we got some uh, over here, what is this, executives, oh, never mind, I have not even checked that before, so I never knew about that. Alright, so, as far as I'm concerned, there's only new outfits where you can put on the Santa costume, there are some new festive tops, as you can see in the previous gameplay, which I just showed you now. And uh, so I think there might be some accessories. Let me go ahead and check the accessories. Um, scarves? No, this is um, the ill-gotten games. Oh, I'm going way too far now. Okay, so let's go ahead and go look at the ties. All right, we got these two new ties. That's pretty cool, which I can't really put on. Um, and let me go ahead and put on a t-shirt for you guys, and then I can uh, put it on. Alright, let's go over to the top section once again. Uh, find a suitable shirt I can put on. There we go. Let's just go down here. Alright, so these shirts should be around here somewhere. Which one should I put on? Which one do I need to put on, actually? I need the one with the closed uh, buttons. There we go. Let's just put on one of these. Uh, let's go back over to the accessories and uh, put on the ties to see how it looks. Hopefully it's a good tie. Uh, I think it might be designed or something. I'm not too sure. Let's go ahead and check it out. Alright, if I can find it, obviously. Where is it? I've got so many ties. Alright, there they are. Um, okay, probably not the best tie. They could have added something more unique to the ties. But there we go. It's the Santa tie anyways. Pretty awesome as well. So, I'm going to go ahead and put back on this uh, thing now. Wait, what's going on here? Alright, let's go accessories. Wait, is there new scarves? No, wait. I already checked this, didn't I? Alright, never mind. Alright, so let's go ahead and um, put on the outfits now. Where Where's the Santa costume? Alright, there we go. Alright, let's get out of the uh, clothes store now because I've spent way too much time on the clothes store. Let's head right over to the mask store. Alright guys, so we have arrived at the mask store. So we're going to go ahead and look over to the festive section. That's where all the new masks will be located from the festive surprise DLC for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all the new masks now. And uh, so you guys do have an idea, of course, what it, all the masks look like in advance obviously so when you go ahead on to gt5 online you do know which mask you might want to buy or maybe so uh we've got all these cool masks and it's pretty awesome like how they've actually made this all like really cool for your online character as well so uh we're gonna go ahead and just scroll down more so you've got awesome oh there we go the santa mask right there as well and a little cookie, which is pretty nice. Um, we've got all this uh, sort of cool stuff that you can put on. Pretty nice, actually. I like that. All right, so the S is the... Uh, these are the old ones. All right, never mind that. So these are all the new ones on the top. And uh, these are the old ones on the bottom as well. So this is new. So I'm going to put on the bad Santa one. And uh, as you can see, the skin gets lighter and darker. 
Uh, so this is pretty cool as well. All right, so we're gonna put on the bandstand uh, mask. There we go, guys. So that is pretty awesome. You guys can check out. All right, guys. So before we get any further into the DLC of the festive surprise DLC itself, I just want to mention a few things. Like the vehicle is not actually in the update as of right now. Neither is the snow as well, so which is quite unfortunate, really. But uh, in a few days, it will be out in a uh, couple of days, like on 23rd of December, I believe, or maybe 24th. Well, those are the rumors, but there's not actually a confirmed date as of right now. But yeah, I've checked these websites. I've checked Legendary Motorsport, Savin San Andreas, and uh, so I've been unable to find it, so which is quite unfortunate. But I really did want to actually like buy it and uh, show how you guys can uh, see what the performance is of the car's top speed maybe and all that sort of good stuff but like uh, it's not really on there so there we go guys I uh, just wanted to clear that out the way so you guys uh, don't obviously put any hate on me because I didn't check it obviously I've also checked the Benny's uh, original motor works as well I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be on there obviously but yeah there we go guys so I uh, just wanted to clear that out of the way war stock catch and carry and in case you guys didn't know the executive uh, car is right there as well I did not actually know that before so I never really go on this website that much it's mostly a legendary motorsport and uh, Salvin San Andreas website that I go on but there we go guys just want to clear that out the way for you guys so let's go ahead and check over over to the new Christmas trees that they have added into Grand Theft Auto 5 Online. The almighty Christmas tree is here my friends. Welcome to this awesome Christmas tree in the festive surprise DLC for you guys. So this is like the awesome Christmas tree that always Rockstar Games add in to GTA 5 Online when there is Christmas DLC updates for you guys to check out. So this is a sign, a most likely a remembrance of how Christmas would be celebrated in GTA 5 Online. So the uh, Christmas tree would always be here. So this is you can like always check it out when you come over to this location. And in case you guys do want to know where this location is, uh, you just want to go over to the map and uh, press start and it's right in the middle of the map somewhere and uh, it's around Benny's workshop and Los Santos customs which is the Legion Square location so it'll be like a block with some lines around it and so that's where you'll know where to come so this is the awesome remembrance of the Christmas DLC surprise uh, update for you guys to check out there is uh, one more thing I want to show you guys for this update as well which is the Christmas tree which is located in all your apartments that you guys can check out so if you go over to your apartment which I am uh, doing right now you will see a Christmas tree and uh, there are presents that you can see as well which is pretty awesome so there we go guys that is pretty much it for this festive surprise DLC I've uh, pretty much covered everything I think, uh, I'm not too sure if I've missed out anything. If I have missed out anything then do leave it down in the video section uh, comments down below and just let me know what you guys uh, think that I missed out maybe. And so that is pretty much it, please be sure to leave a like on the video as it does show your support towards my videos and my upcoming videos. And if you are new around here then why not subscribe for more GTA 5 content available on my channel for you guys to check out. So, as always, stay awesome my deagles and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.